Good evening and welcome to another presentation of Mac Women's Soccer here on ESPN+. Plus. The Duquesne Dukes come into the Niagara Frontier as the Niagara University Purple Eagles set to host the Dukes in what promises to be a very good non-conference matchup. As you saw, the Dukes coming in at 2-1-1 one and, one and Niagara University at 3-1. Again, good evening. I'm Frank Gill. Thank you for joining us. Again, these two schools have found their stride offensively in this fall season after struggling offensively in the spring, but we'll get to that later in the tail of the tape. Let's give you a couple players to keep your eyes on, and there are a couple of freshman contributors. For the Dukes, it's number 28, Emma Bundy, the freshman from Wexford, PA, already with three goals and assists in four games, and one of those goals was a game winner in their last game at the 53 minute. Bundy would find the net and have the Duquesne Dukes beat out. Keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep going. On the other side, it's going to be Maya McLean. McLean, two goals scored against Cleveland State, also being honored with conference recognition as she is the MAC Rookie of the Week following a very strong effort against Cleveland State, looking to keep that rolling here against the Dukes. As I was mentioning, let's take a look at the numbers coming into this matchup. For the Purple Eagles, three and a half goals per game. Duquesne comes in at 1.75. They've already eclipsed their total goals scored from the spring season. For Niagara, they've really sprung to light offensively. They're led by Valancourt, who has 14 points on the season. Their shot percentage at 29.2, 13.2 for Duquesne. And you see Duquesne with 13.3 shots per game to Niagara at a dozen. Yellow cards fairly even. Neither team has been issued a red card this season. When we... Yep. I 